Welcome to the virtual library provided through your school to meet all of your information needs. This tutorial is designed to help you get started in using this site. While we've tried to design the website to make it as easy to use as possible, we realize that sometimes users just need a tour. On screen right now is our homepage. This page contains many of the most frequently used tools within the library. It contains direct links to our Ask a Librarian, right here, where you can request help from a librarian for a project. It also contains a link to request a book, which allows you to request a book or item for the library to purchase. If you scroll down, we also provide a list of quick links to sites that you may want to access quickly. Our homepage can also be considered your one stop for searching. We provide a Google search bar which, which searches our entire site for the keywords you enter. For example, if I type in the word technology and click on search, this will bring up a list of all the pages within our website that contain or relate to the word technology. If you click on any of these links, it will take you directly to that page. On the right hand side of our homepage, we have the catalog search bar, which can be used to access all of the resources that our library has. If I type in a keyword such as cats and then click on keyword, it will open up a list of all of the books within our library catalog relating to cats. However, our catalog also links to all of our resources beyond books, including paid database subscriptions. This includes the databases provided by BadgerLink. In order to access those paid resources, you must be logged into the catalog with your student ID number and password. For information on how to log into the catalog to access these resources, please see the tutorial video on using Destiny OneSearch, which is available on our tutorials page of our site. Our homepage can also give you direction. Towards the bottom of the homepage, you will find a mind map that will help direct you to the page you should check out based on what you've come to the site for. If you have a general idea of what you want, answering the questions on the mind map will help direct you to the correct menu to use. If I enlarge this, it asks, what brings you here? To get help? to share my wisdom, to get my game on, to try and find information that is neither a book nor research materials, to find materials, or to find a book. So if I were looking for gaming information, I would go through the get my game on. It then tells me to use the connect menu bar, then click on the gamer's corner. If you aren't sure where you want to go once you get to our site or where you need to go once you get to our site, this mind map will be invaluable. The first thing you may notice after examining the homepage is the navigation bar across the top of the website. Your purpose for visiting the site will help determine where you want to go and which menu bar you should use. Our read menu bar provides resources for those interested in finding or sharing good books. If you actually click on the word read, which is a link, you can suggest a book for the library to purchase or join in on the book chatter and discover what other virtual library community members have been reading. If you've come to the virtual library website to find information, you've come to the right place. Our research menu will connect you with a plethora of resources to find different kinds of information along with tools to help you evaluate or cite sources. If you have a paper to write or just need to find information to help you with a hobby, this menu bar will help you find the information and determine if that information is useful.
If you need websites to help you with a particular subject area, look no further. Our Classes menu bar links to a page for each subject area. Each page contains numerous links to sites that will help you with that particular subject area, whether it's art, math, English, etc. Do you like using technology for your homework? If so, the Get Techie menu contains technology resources that could be used to create projects for a class, or even if you just want to use it for something in your personal life. If you are looking for technology help, check out the tutorials under this menu. Also, if you know a lot about using different technologies, check out the blog on the Get Techie page where you can share your expertise in the blog. The Connect menu is for those looking to connect. Whether you want news or wish to converse with others with similar interests such as gaming or other hobbies, this menu is where you should go. We even have a page on connecting with experts. For teachers visiting the site, the Teach menu provides resources and links to help in regards to curriculum standards, RTI, and other education initiatives, along with links to schedules. Do you need assistance with something? Use the Help menu. The site provides both tutorials and frequently asked questions. If you need help with research for a project, use the Ask a Librarian page where you can fill out a form telling us about the project you are working on and what you need help with. A librarian will get back to you within 48 hours, hopefully with the information that you need. In addition, underneath the help menu, you can always use the Contact Us page, which gives you information for contacting librarians during normal hours, or you can use the chat feature at the bottom of the page to live chat with a librarian. If you would rather learn more about the virtual library, check out the About Us menu. It includes information about staff members, along with information about the library's decision-making process on the Policies page. However, you may be more interested in our Code of Ethics, which outlines our promises to you, the user. Our last menu is the More menu. It contains resources for parents and a showcase for student work. Also, if you would like to give the library a suggestion or a compliment, feel free to use the Tell Us What You Think page. We welcome your suggestions. Our site has a lot to offer. We hope you find it useful. However, we know that sometimes you just can't find what you are looking for. Please feel free to contact us at any time to get assistance in what you need. We are always happy to help. Enjoy!